begin with, in a very tactical sense, everything we do depends on our ability to professionally develop staff because supply and demand is so out of whack around the Atlanta area that we have firmly decided the only way we can develop the talent and competencies we need is to develop them. So we hire them earlier, earlier in their career and we invest in them. And, and the rule is we're going to spend 3% of our budget every year on training and professional development. In good times or bad, you can cut our budget 50% and, and, and heaven forbid that ever happen, but we're going to spend 3% of what's left on sending the people to conferences like this or, or investing in uh, in other training and we're very very comfortable that some of those folks are going to stay and some of those folks are going to advance their career and we want people to simply just make informed choices so people who have thought about a higher paying job in the corporate world we've given them you know context with other people who came to higher education from corporate and share what that perspective like because many times it can be different it can be a more siloed kind of working experience it's not as holistic and, and diverse in terms of the challenges so you know, at the end of the day, our ability to be successful is entirely dependent on our ability to, to get people at that point in their career where we can really shape them into being strong employees.